What's up miners, welcome to another video. In this video I will show you how to mine Verge using the Ominable app and some other programs for the CPU and GPU that will deliver better performance for you. So if you are not familiar with Verge, I will leave a link in the description so you can check it out. And also if you go to coingecko.com and you look for the coin there, we can see it's a ranking in position 233 with a price of 0.018 which is ideal for mining in onminable.com because you are going to get more coins okay um, first thing that you need to do is get a wallet for this coin you have some options like atomic wallet trust wallet guarda wallet for example um, all the links are going to be in the description after that you are probably going to need a windows uh, exclusion in a folder a security exclusion so you just go to windows security and we are going to uh, click virus and threat protection then <clears throat> manage uh, settings scroll down to exclusions add an exclusion to a folder and um, under the desktop i created one folder exclusions you can do the same and select it and place the exclusion there it will allow you to download all the miners files all the files that are necessary without them being flagged as um, malware even though they are not, but uh, that's the way it, it is. So um, we go to onminable.com after that, and then click download, download the file on the left. Okay, you're going to download it inside, the, inside your folder. You're going to press Ctrl J, and you're going to keep dangerous file, keep anyway, show in folder, for example. And then from there, you just extract the file. Click here, extract here. You will get this file, which is the onminable um, miner app. You will right click it and run as administrator. Once the program loads, you click continue. If you have a graphics card with uh, at least four gigabytes of memory, you just select graphics card, otherwise CPU, click next. Then we are going to find um, the coin here. So just type XVG and then enter a, an address for the coin, okay? You can use this code, which is E4XD-WMZL. This will allow you to drop the uh, pool fee from 1% to 0.75%. You can click start. Allow a couple of minutes uh, for this um, process to ramp up. Uh, check your settings in the meantime. Uh, make sure your intensity is set as high. You have a name for the worker. You have your code. You can click save and restart. Uh, in the lower left corner, after a couple of seconds, you are going to get your hash rate around 1,300, 1,400, something like that in my case. This confirms that it is connecting to the mining pool and is mining. Okay. So I'm going to stop now and I'm going to show you a different way of mining using the mining programs directly and this will deliver better performance for you. So this is the second way of mining and it is using the um, mining programs directly. So we have XM rig only to mine with the CPU and Gminer for example or Phoenix Miner to mine with the GPU. I'm going to demonstrate uh, XM rig. I did two modifications to the file, to the program. One is dropping the um, the fee or the donation fee that you have to pay to XMRIC to 0% and the other one is creating this file that uh, helps you with the configuration of the program so it's already let's say pre-configured it will all uh, request all the details that you need so the coin then uh, the address for that coin a location uh, a name for the worker and from there just wait a couple of seconds hit enter again and the program starts okay we can see the donation fee at 0%. We can see the connections to the unminable pool. This confirms that we are connecting and mining. Now, after this, let's uh, leave it running for a while and let's do the demonstration with Gminer, for example. So we right click start mining. This file will ask for all the details uh, for the configuration instead of you having to configure everything by hand. So just type the coin, in this case, XVG. Then the address, uh, location, a name for the um, worker, and before that, um, if your card has four gigabytes, type etc hash. If your card has more than four gigabytes, type etc hash. Then just um, enter the name of the worker. It could be something like worker GPU, for example. Hit enter, and at this point, the program starts. In my case, I'm not gonna be mining because it's just one gigabyte card. This is the card I use for recording. So this is just a demonstration of how you would start the program. You will see in your case, um, the, the program starts building the DAG uh, and, and that goes to 100%. After that, it makes all the connections to the mining pool that confirms that you are mining. 
if we go back to XMRIG, we can type the um, letter H and we can see the hash, uh, the hash rate and the speed, which in my case is around 1,700, uh, a little bit more than what we had before. Just make sure that you increase the Windows virtual memory, that you connect via wired Ethernet instead of Wi-Fi, that you close as many programs as you can. All of that will give you a higher hash rate, okay? I'm available to help uh, in Telegram. The link is in the description. You can contact me there um, with any questions. If you need help with the setup or the optimization, don't worry. I'm happy to help. This is all there is to it. And uh, thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you on the next video, okay?